Hello, Christian here. Jared Leilauna, suspected shooter at a Tucson, Arizona supermarket, which killed at least five people on January 8, 2011, is an atheist. Does this prove atheism leads to mental illness? Does this prove atheism inspires murder? The atheists out there will be no doubt quick to say no. Perhaps they will even scream that it does not. They may even get angry over the very suggestion or the question. Think back. Think back, however, to April 2009 when a self-professed Christian YouTuber, Anthony Powell, murdered a girl, Asia McGowan, with whom he was obsessed, and then himself on the campus of the Henry Ford Community College in Dearborn, Michigan. If you don't remember or don't know about this event, Google it, or even search YouTube, as there are many, many atheists exploiting that crime. See, many atheists were and still are quick to not only point out Powell's Christianity, but also to the idea that this peruse religion, if it does not cause mental illness, certainly nurtures it by, among other things, encouraging people to stay clear from professional treatment of the illness. Many also found it appropriate to blame Venom Fang X for the murder suicide because Power was apparently a fan of his. In a short, many atheists are quick to point the finger at religion or some particular religion for allowing and or encouraging the crimes and other violent behavior of a person who happens to hold religious views. These atheists cannot point to any substantive evidence or logical reason for such a conclusion, but rather it seems to be derived from their anti-religion prejudice and hate than anything else. Thus, following the same logic and approach, perhaps atheism should be blamed for the violence committed by atheists. In Launa, we have an atheist who went on a murder spree. An atheist whose MySpace and YouTube accounts paint a picture of a psychologically disturbed man vehemently and militantly against religion, God, and the U.S. government. Is there, then, a link between atheism and this type of state of mind? Though their precise philosophical foundations may have differed somewhat, we have seen many atheists just like Launa in the past. Picker, Eric, Alvinin, Ted Bundy, Jeffrey Dahmer, Eric Harris, and Dylan Klebold, Cho Sung Hue, Matty Sare, and Russell Williams, to name a few. Thus, I ask, is it fair and time to put the blame on atheism for encouraging and fomenting the thoughts and actions that lead atheists to murder the same way atheists have blamed religion? After all, the common thread among these atheists is, is, their atheism. Until next time, God bless you.